the main factor is the vision uh, in terms of once these uh, founders are starting the business upfront these guys have got a vision of growing internationally and as the products are developed keeping in mind the need of international uh, consumers versus just making it a uh, india centric product government support has been uh, very strong last 4 5 years and what is also aided is uh, what has happened in the uh, overall ecosystem of uh, telecom and internet space uh people have access to fast speed internet uh also lack of jobs uh, has also triggered uh, a space where people are looking startup as an option uh, all these things have been working in tandem uh along with uh, success stories uh, which have come from india government support has held at a very very macro level so till now if i remember correct, correctly there are about 30 regulatory changes implemented by the government right around the startup ecosystem the most recent one being the abolishing of angel tax for recognized startups right the pass through of tax benefits for alternate investment funds right so at a broad level the government is trying to ease by reducing the regulatory burden as well as increasing the fund availability and capital availability in the ecosystem the most important thing is they are relevant uh, they're relevant to the markets in the ecosystem whatever startup which is actually going globally right now is taking indian formula but definitely they're making the adjustments and relevance to the markets that they are going to i think the attitude of entrepreneurs today is of uh, self belief you know so nobody is uh, i won't say nobody but most of them are not uh, afraid of losing out or failing which is something 10 years back we had a lot you know because startup ecosystem was just developing now entrepreneurs are taking more risks so they are striking it big so sometimes they're losing out but most of the time i think indian startups have have now started to you know make the mark looking at the global market from day one where they're trying to possibly build a solution which over time will grow in the indian market but also will cater to the global market which is very important mindset because it's very tough to go back to the drawing boards later we you know we do have a cost advantage you know which was which played out really well in the service industry many years back and now i think it can play out really well in the product industry also uh and as we build the ecosystem we will have a strong network of you know mentors and people who've done it once so that should fuel a new set of innovation so i think this will really help india uh, you know indian companies do well globally i think the government also is aiding in multiple ways i think for the first time what's happened is the startup ecosystem seems a little bit more organized there is efforts in policy in uh, financing funding uh events and even the ecosystem coming together in a much more in institutional way